Hi everyone, welcome to my channel. I hope you all are great and doing fantastic in your life. My name is Zirupa. So today I am going to share what are the updates that have been made in Gudufa 3 with respect to Gudufa 2. So if you are new to this term Gudufa, please go and watch my part 1 of this video in which I have talked about the basic information about the Gudufa. I will give the link in the description box of this video. So go and watch that first so that you can get better understanding of whatever I am going to share in this video. So now, in general way, if I need to describe what is Gudufa, Gudufa is Generic Drug User Fee Amendment. It is a program under US FDA, which was first introduced in 2012. This program was introduced to reduce the review cycle and approval process of generic drug applications. So Gudufa 3 is the third reauthorization of this program. It means that it is a third time update in this program, which is being effective from October 22 to September 2027 means that it is a five year program. There are five key updates under this program. Number one is fee have been increased by 11% for the generic drug manufacturers. This fee will be utilized to fund the review and approval process of generic drug applications. Number two is FD has committed to maintain and improve the rate of first cycle review of generic drug applications. Number three is FD has also committed to reduce the backlog of generic drug applications which were spending for review and also committed that they will reduce the review time cycle of generic drug applications from 15 month to 12 month by end of Gudufa 3. Gudufa also includes that FDA will use from now onwards the risk based approach to determine the frequency of inspections of drug product manufacturing facilities. This risk based approach will depend on the complexity of the product and also depends upon the compliance history of the facility. And number five is under Gudufa 3 program, FDA will provide incentive to the company and facilitates the partnership between the manufacturer and the academia to develop more complex generic drugs and also provide incentive to the manufacturer to develop and produce more complex generic drugs. In this way, FDA will encourage the development and research of complex generic drugs. So overall, Gudufa 3 aims to improve the quality, efficacy, safety and availability of generic drug into the public domain and also wants to reduce the review and approval process of generic drug applications. So with that, we come to end of this video. I hope you like this video. If you like this video, please subscribe this channel, share with your friends and hit the like button. Thank you so much for watching. Bye bye.